Hey guys, and welcome back to the vlog. I realize I, I kind of look like a burglar in my uh, outfit today, but I'm not feeling that well, so I didn't want to wash my hair because why? And uh, I'm cold, so I have a hat on, and then I just thought this would look cute, so I'm going with the, the burglar look. But it is about three o'clock. I haven't vlogged yet today. Haven't been feeling well, like I said. And we spent the morning clearing off our deck, like our patio, because snow is coming. Snow is on its way. Like I know for a fact it'll be here soon. So we wanted to clear all that out and put it into our garage for the winter. And it's just been a weird day. So last night, after I ended the vlog, I basically decided that my back has been hurting a lot this week and I blame our bed. So we've had this mattress for five years and I'm pretty sure the previous owners who were Alex's like family friends had it for like 10 years. So it was a very long time for a mattress that has traveled four different apartments just with us alone. So it, it's time to say goodbye. But last night I decided that I just couldn't sleep on it anymore. I just didn't want to. So I ended up pulling a king size mattress out of here by myself. And I just had it up against that wall back there, but then Gallifrey like jumped on it and I was terrified it was gonna crush him in the middle of the night. So I moved that to another bedroom. And then I took the bed out of our main guest bedroom and put it in here. So this bed, is on our king size like platform and I slept really well but it was also a crazy idea to do by myself because Alex was streaming and I didn't want to be like hey stop your streaming I'm deciding to move beds around but I really enjoyed it so I'm pretty sure we'll be buying a new bed this is one of those like bed from boxes sort of situation and we've been doing research and I think we're just gonna go with the same like brand but in a king size but it looks really funny because it's obviously a foot shorter and man that foot makes a difference. Alex sleeps like the number four and he takes about two-thirds of whatever bed we're in and so I need that extra foot for my sanity for sure. But all of that aside I switched beds around and all that and then this morning I woke up to a very exciting package it was from Erin Condren and I thought dang I just placed an order yesterday how did it get here so fast but it's actually a PR package for my upcoming gift guide because I'm gonna do a uh, blog post all about the best things to buy for Erin Condren from Erin Condren if you need like gifts and stuff for planner people not planner people the like so they sent me some stuff over so I wanted to show you guys because some of it is not out yet and I'm very excited and I also know of a couple of things that are coming out. I'm not sure if I'm supposed to spoil them or not but they didn't tell me not to. So I know that they are coming out with one of those mini petite planners as a gratitude journal. Really excited about that and they also are doing another wrapping paper book. I can't remember what else they have coming, but some of the stuff is right here, right now, so I'm gonna show you. So this first thing is a new version of their desktop calendar. I had their last year one, and honestly, I prefer this one so much more. So it is about half the size, but they have quotes on the back, and they're a really great size for putting in your traveler's notebook, like on the front page or whatever, or putting in a bullet journal, and they're all metallic and like a bunch of different colors. So I'm really excited about that. That is super awesome. Then they sent some of the petite journals. So these are the baby tracker and the pregnancy journal. I'm just gonna save these for any family or friends that get pregnant. I already have two sets of both, so this will just be a third set that I keep. And then I have been eyeing the meal planner, but I never got around to purchasing it. So I'm very excited to give it a go. Alex and I are trying. I feel like everyone is always constantly trying to meal plan. So I'm excited to see if this helps for us. It just has a bunch of these pages with spots to write in the meals, a shopping list, and then they, the meal prep strategy, which you could write down like when you're preparing food and what. And then this is like a dinner meal plan for like events and parties, so that's really cool. And then also comes with a sticker sheet in the back with adorable stickers. So really excited about this. Then they also sent over the 
uh, clutch, the planty pack, but this one is in blue. I have the black one, so it was really cool saying the blue color. Then this next thing is a brand new product. I had no idea they were coming out with it whatsoever, so when I opened the package, I was like freaking out. This is a designer laptop case, and honestly, it seems kind of small. It definitely wouldn't fit mine. Actually, it might. No, no, but it's too small. My laptop's not the right size, but if you have like a Mac or something, this would be a really great thing for that, but I think I'd want to use it for just like carrying professional documents. It's a really nice kind of like pad folio thing that has these magnetic clasps right here and then it opens up into like a place you can slip stuff in. So I might just use it for something like that or give it to someone who does have a uh, case this size, but it's coming out in two colors. I'm pretty sure it's two colors. Yeah, it's gonna be this like rose gold metallic. I'm gonna show you. This like rose gold case. That would be crazy cool. And I don't know if this has come out yet, but this is another option for the personalized clutch. Another really cool thing. And then this is the gratitude journal that I desperately want. I want that one so bad. They also sent over a 2018 hardbound life planner, which is great because I don't have a hardbound for my planner video coming up. So very excited about this and I haven't measured it. I feel like I must have gotten the right sizing or understood the sizing, but I might just give it a measure and see what stickers will work in here. But probably do a giveaway with this or give it to a family member or a friend. Then this is funny because in the order I placed yesterday, I actually ordered one of these. I wanna do a series or a video about creating like a command center for your family. So I have a wall calendar from Bloom. I'm pretty sure Bloom Planners. And I wanted to get this one as well for like different options in the video. And so I purchased one, but this one obviously came early. So I'm gonna gift the other one away to, I'm pretty sure Alex's mom. I don't think she watches our videos, but uh, it has a pocket and she always wants pockets for them. But it's just a really cute quote calendar. And there is a giant sheet of stickers in the back that's actually removable, so that's really cool. And then there's a spot for like personal information and stuff. So I think this will be a really cool surprise for her because she always wants calendars every year with pockets. And most of the time they're just really like old looking, like with birds, and it just seems like your great grandma would own it. So this is a lot more fun and fresh, and I think she'll really appreciate all the nice sayings but that was everything that they sent and i am still shocked by it like how amazingly cool is that i feel very fortunate to uh be able to get supplies and planner stuff for my content so i'm very excited about all the new stuff this is definitely going to be something i purchase for gifts because it's really cool this i'm excited to see if i can use in a different style and yeah just really exciting wake up call. So I just took one of our postcards and cut the tiniest little bit off the top and the bottom, or at least the sides, and I put it in one of my uh, Chic Sparrow dashboards. I love it. This is what I had in mind when I started to include postcards in every order to be able to cut them or adapt them to use in your traveler's notebook or actually send them, but this worked out perfectly. This is the, the size that I cut off, like the tiniest amount on either side. So very, very excited about that. And then the uh, little acetate on top is super cute. Look at my handsome boy. Hey bud. How you doing? Just hanging out? Just hanging out in your cat castle? Like the king that you are? Cat on, my friend. Cat on. So Alex just said, we're gonna go get our bed. The round. But we have the craft show set up in three hours. I don't know why I'm always like, we can't go run errands, we only have three hours. That's probably enough time. I'm digging this look. Alex says I kind of look like I'm about to uh, break out some real awesome slam poetry. Where's my bongo? Da -da -da -da. Sometimes I walk, but now I run so fast to the sky at last. I know you're my wife, but, but I, I, I want to punch you just the same way I want to punch any of them. So good job. Da -da -da. 
All right, let's go get a bed. Hey, boys and girls. So we got a bed. <laughs> um, and it's apparently huge. Uh, it's huge. There's a there was a king size well, bed back we, there. We tried to last year when we got the queen. It fit in the back of a Honda Civic. So this year we're putting it in the back of the uh, Toyota, Toyota Matrix. Matrix. Hey, hey. So that's uh, look at that. We're one of them fancy hippies that drive around in one of them VW vans with those hats with the bags. bed in the back. Look at that. We're moving <laughs> up in the world. So we had the most fun at Costco we've ever had. We looked at tires, tires. and bought a bed. And we know when the secret deals come yeah, out for the tires. Yeah, they told us when the tire sale was. Yeah, Jimbo behind the counter, he was like, let me tell you about- <laughs> that Jimbo. No, actually, I think it was Hernandez. <laughs> so anyways, uh, they were helping us behind the counter and they were like, hey, by the way, the tires you want are gonna go on sale in like two days, come back then. And so we're gonna wait yeah, for those. It's like a week. A know? week. Um, but we're gonna come back for those because it's a great deal. They install it for a penny, which is obviously you get, like, free rotations free. and stuff, which I think is where I went wrong with my tires. I just didn't maintain them. And with winter literally here, it's 27 degrees outside Fahrenheit. Uh, it's it's time to get better tires. Yeah. But now we are headed to Meyer and trying to get out of the Costco parking lot, which is always fun. It's hell. So the and the reason why oh, that um, way too yeah that guy is making mistakes. Uh, so one thing my dad taught me, uh, um, one thing my dad taught me that I am a firm believer in is anything that keeps you in contact with the ground, do not go cheap on. So your shoes, your bed, your tires, those are the three things you just don't chintz on because you, you, if you it's get cheap, hurt you. exactly, if you get cheap shoes and they hurt your feet or they, you know, they cause some kind of injury because they're not supportive enough. That's gonna wreck you for the rest of your life. You get a bad back, like this big guy, that messes up everything. Like I can't tell you how many times I look at like, oh no, I gotta pick up the basket off the ground and I'm like, am I gonna hurt myself because I can't lift and it? And we're 20. Yeah, and I'm, tw I'm 26. Yeah. So yeah. Much more I'm, mature than her. So much more mature. So we are getting a lot of those new things yeah, today. Yeah, so I just need a new pair of but shoes. But we think we have something very exciting. Hopefully we can find it and we'll show you guys. Oh. It's, I haven't told them about it. I right. barely remembered about it, so we're- Well, so, so a few months ago, someone contacted us and was like, hey, by the way, I'm from this thing and are you interested about this opportunity? And we we're, were like, like- Of course, why not? I, more, it wasn't even, are you interested in this opportunity? It was, hey, can we use your product in this thing? And we were like, yeah, of course, like, oh my gosh, I was so excited, but it was months ago, so I didn't even, we forgot, and then all of a sudden, our order, the, what regular orders changed. This one product became very popular, which is, it is a popular product, but not this popular. In like, in multiple quantities. Yeah, like, you don't normally buy more than one of these. So, we uh, are hoping to find what we're talking about. So, I'm sitting there, and I'm going, okay, well, what? Think, 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 Alex, you know, as I'm eating honey. And uh, finding out, I'm like, oh my gosh, this is the product that they got. And it was because it was two emails, and that was it. The whole thing was done. It was the question, I sent what they asked, and then it was a thank you. Um, but it's out now. And we don't know if it's in it, and we got to find it. We've gone to two stores already, and they, don't, they haven't had what we're looking for. But again, Target and Costco aren't really going to have this item, so we'll see. We'll see. We're excited. Oh, what do you think it is? Before what do you think? we tell Before you, you go, comment, comment, pause the video, comment. What do you think it is? I guess that then, would be kind of fun. And then let us know if you are right, if we can yeah. find it. If we can't find it, we'll tell you. But And then what we'll do is we'll take all their comments and then go after those because obviously those are good revenues. Clever yeah. marketing. They're doing our research for us. They think we belong there. Yeah, they're like, you belong there. That's your thing. Anyways, okay, we'll uh, jump cut. Bye. It wasn't at Meyer, but it's probably at Barnes and Noble. Hint, hint, hint. He's upset I took the camera off before you get to see this. <laughs> wow, wow. Oh, hey, where oh. are we? <laughs> this is just a- Just other magazine. Pedestrian. Oh. Oh, what is it? What have you got here? I'm What's, just leaf through this. this. country living? Oh, that's a nice, this what, a lovely so cover. Cool. Oh, oh, oh. What, what is that? Are we, wow, are wow. we in stocking stuffers? Is that us? It's focusing. Yes, it is. Because we have adorable stocking stuffers, and that's what's been selling like crazy off our website. So we're buying three of them. Because <laughs> we're going crazy. Even the camera can't handle it. So we're just really, really excited. It's kind of cool. 
But, so uh yeah our sales just went crazy for those like not amazing not like hey we we're good we've for had, christmas like, we had like five sales with like multiple yeah like businesses. back to back to back so it was just interesting so super cool uh and just that pattern too which was interesting so now now we have to figure out how to buy things not online where is there a place do we just leave Can I use my business card right today? yeah oh absolutely so now we're kind of in crunch time because <laughs> We were supposed to set up our craft booth in about 30 minutes. We don't have the truck yet. I still got Bancroft here and it's six o'clock. He's probably starving. Mom's like, where's my dog? But we're getting into this thing. You looking for scissors? Yeah. All right, I'll find him some scissors. Oh. Look at that e echo. I know. Weird. Like it's super weird. It, like Just one bed missing and it does all that. There you go, a little cape. It's just on the floor. Your phone? Yeah, it was like, out, it fell out of my coat. <sighs> so the bed is gonna keep getting bigger and bigger. Um, the last time we did this, it got, it's probably gonna be about here. Yeah. It, when it's all said and done. Cause it's about, um, I mean, a l like two or three more inches. Yeah, well, isn't that what I, did it, I say here? Yeah, well, like you're here. doing men's measurements, babe. All right, let's go do this craft show. All right. Bah -bah. Dad made food, he said we could have some. I already ate pizza, what do you mean? Sausage and potatoes. All right, well. So we are at the, he's just eating a Reese's peanut butter cup. We're at the Byron Center High School for the craft show that's tomorrow. So you can set up the night before. We're in this hallway. Do they know who we are? Putting us in a hallway, please. But we're trying to figure it out. because We're never, in a magazine. We're in a magazine. But I've never been in such a weird space before, so we're just making it up as we go, basically. So this is as far as we got before they said that it's time to leave because it is like 8.30, 8, 9 o'clock-ish. So we're pretty far. We just have to stuff um, more cards. We have to finish that at home, but it's a little messy right now. I'll figure it out tomorrow. We're going to put this a different thing up over here. All right guys, so we just got home. This little guy's been making so much noise since we got home. The background is so in focus and not me. There we go. But I am gonna say good night here so I can finish this vlog and get it up before the show tomorrow. We have to be there by like 8.30, but we might get there a little bit early to make sure everything's set up. But thanks so much for watching and I hope you enjoyed the vlog. It was a pretty busy one, lots of stuff happened. So thanks for tuning in. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. And uh, we'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye. Gallifrey, Gallifrey, he likes to bite the camera.